This is for the Touch Trainer VizX external visual system. This will be a troubleshooting guide on how to actually set up the NVIDIA surround in the correct orientation and general troubleshooting tips. Um, in case some of your monitors are black or aren't showing up correctly, um, the first thing to do is to open the NVIDIA control panel. To do that, you can right click anywhere and then go to the NVIDIA control panel shown right here. This will bring up um, what we'll use to do all of the configuration. First, to set up multiple displays, this will be in case displays are showing black or aren't showing up at all, you have to go into the display tab and on the last one down it says set up multiple displays. When you go to that setting, it will show all the displays that can be activated. Um, first, make sure that all of them are checked. After that is done, we'll be able to now set up the NVIDIA surround. To do that, go to the 3D settings in the NVIDIA control panel. On the last tab down, go to the configure surround physics X. Under the surround configuration, check the box that says span displays with surround and hit configure. Um, this will bring up a tab or a menu that shows which displays you want to put in the surround mode. All of them should say Acer S231HL, which are the top displays shown. Hit apply and the screens will go black for a second and they will come up with the identifying numbers. So after the displays show up with the numbers shown, you want to match the numbers on the displays with the corresponding numbers in your configuration display menu. As shown, we see a 2, a 1, and a 3 here, and we want to match those up with the correct numbers on the actual surround display. After the numbers are matched up in the correct order, you want to hit apply. The screens will intermittently go black again and should come up in the correct orientation. A menu displays showing, asking you if you want to use bezel correction and we want to use bezel correction, so click the top yes, add spatial resolutions. Um, a box will appear showing a road and you want to match up the road. For our touch trainer VizX system, 110 degrees or 110 is the known value that you want to type into the display. And on the menu, when you type 110, it automatically and puts it for the left and the right monitor. Now click create resolutions and again the screens will go black and another menu will pop up. After the bezel correction is done, a window will, will appear that says set resolution to control surround. There's a um, button on the bottom that says add or remove resolutions and you want to click on that button. On the list on the left, Find the resolution that says 4983 by 900 and in, a pre in parentheses says bezel corrected. You want to make sure that that is in the active window of your resolutions. Once that is done, hit OK and then finish to create resolutions. Now as you can see, the top displays are shown are in the correct orientation, but the bottom displays have gone black. In order to activate the bottom two displays, you have to go to the Set Up Multiple Displays, which is under the Display tab in the NVIDIA Control Panel. When you go to the Set Up Multiple Displays, you have to click or click the checkbox for the two monitors that aren't activated. After you do this, you'll hit apply, and this will turn on the bottom two monitors. Hit yes to keep your applied changes. Now, you must change the resolution of the three monitors. To do that, you go to the display tab in the NVIDIA control panel and click on the change resolution. The resolutions will be shown 
um, or a list of the resolutions will be shown, and you want to click on the 4983 by 900 bezel corrected as shown before, and then hit apply. You want to apply your changes to keep the resolution the same, and now it is time to configure the displays. To configure the bottom displays and the correct orientation to the top displays, you go to the Set Up Multiple Displays in the NVIDIA Control Panel. As you can see, this, the main long display is now shown as a single display, and the big bottom monitor and the small monitor to the right are in the orientation of one long line. To put this in the correct orientation, you must drag the number one monitor, or the main monitor, to the bottom left hand corner below the long three monitors as shown. To put this in the right orientation, you use the arrow key on the keyboard and that will move the main monitor over in increments of 50 pixels. To get this into the right orientation, you have to go over to the 1550 resolution, which means you have to click the arrow tab 31 times. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Now, grab the number two monitor, which is the small monitor, and drag it over into the corner of the 1 and 3. You should be able to see the 3470 by 900 representing where that monitor is being placed, and that is the correct location. After that is done, hit the apply button, and the screens will go black for a second, and now they will be in the correct orientation. After that is all completed, you are now done setting up the NVIDIA surround for your VizX system. So after you've configured your NVIDIA surround, the last thing you have to do is set up your task bar so that it's in the right location. And to do that, you first go to your NVIDIA control panel, go to the desktop tab, and under surround displays, you want to have the bottom option, maximize windows across all displays checked and only the bottom one, not the confined taskbar to center display. So once that's done, we have to locate our taskbar, which will usually be on your um, three surround monitors. Right click on the taskbar, make sure that it's unlocked. After it's unlocked, you can drag it to your main touch monitor. After that's done, all you have to do is lock it by right-clicking on it and then locking the taskbar. You should see now that the taskbar will go away and will be hidden away from view. And that's all you need to do to orient your taskbar in the right location.